Hey guys and girls on Ask Japanese, this is Kathy Cat, and today I'm angry. I'm really angry. <laughs> I get it. Let's make a video about angry words in Japanese. Huh? Huh? What? It literally just means what, but it's actually a very strong impression, very strong word, and sometimes it's used by young derelicts and such. So if someone ha huh, as you, you should probably be careful. Ha? Huh? Haratatsuwa! <laughs> <laughs> That makes me annoyed. It pretty much literally means your stomach is standing. Maybe it's connected to the fact that your stomach will get upset when you're angry. Mukatsuku. Mukatsuku. I'm so pissed off. I'm so miffed. I'm so angry. Fuzakenna! Stop kidding! Fuzakenna! Fuzakenna! Damatte! Shut up! Damatte! Uh, it means literally annoying, but you can also say it about people. Really wouldn't advise saying it though. What does that even mean? I'm so irritated. Darn it! It can also mean What shall we even do with that person? Like, what do I even do with you? Do what you want! Are you crazy in the head? Are you crazy in the head? Leave me alone. Hmm. Ah, uh, like that. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> So what? It's gonna be trouble. Oh, yeah. Not to Say something. Usotsuki! Liar! Kangaeta koto nai no? Kangaeta koto nai no? Have you not thought of. Senbu mo katsukun jana?
There's no way I can calm down. 自分のせいじゃん It's your fault. さっきに言ってよ Say that first. Now, this is obviously not the proper Japanese yet, like you would get it in a textbook or maybe in a test, but that's casual Japanese, how Japanese people would use it with each other. They're probably dropping the keigo if they're having a proper fight and similar things like that. So the formal language is getting left out and similar things like that. Sometimes the formal language, the formal language is actually going to put, be put in as an extra tool. But generally, this is how Japanese people fight and hope You never have to use it. Of course, there are more anime fighting words that you wouldn't generally use at all, but this is kind of the casual way how Japanese people would fight if you had to know it. And I hope you don't really have to use it in the future. Another thing is that a lot in Japanese anime people are using swear words or similar things like that. You don't really do that because if you use strong words like swear words, which are really not used in the Japanese language, you might hurt someone so much to the point that You can't really make it up to them because they're like, oh my gosh, that person called me this or that. Like, you don't do that. So try to stay away from strong words and especially swear words, even if you know them from watching Naruto or similar. Try not to say that to Japanese people because they might really, really get so angry that there is no way back and you can't really make up to them. That's it from Tokyo today. I hope you have a lovely day. Be nice to each other. I hope you don't have to fight. And I'll catch you soon with another video here on Ask Japanese. Don't forget, like if you haven't already, subscribe if you haven't already, and leave us a comment. Well, how do people fight in your language? How do people fight in your country? Are there things you don't say? Are there things you do say? Please come and let us know. And don't forget, check out our socials down below as well. The director and I do quite a lot of other stuff on social media, so be sure to check us out. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you soon on Ash Japanese. Bye! Nanka ayashi! Nanka ayashi! Nanka ayashi yo!